Paul O'Grady's husband Andre Portasio shared the final photograph they took together in an emotional post following the broadcasting legend's death. Paul O'Grady's husband Andre Portasio took to Instagram on Thursday evening to thank the public for their overwhelming support following the comedian's unexpected death aged 67. The former ballet dancer shared a bittersweet photograph from their final holiday together, and what would be the last picture they ever took together. Andre wrote in his emotional caption, in time I hope to write to everyone individually and thank you for all posts, messages, phone calls, emails, cards and flowers of support. I much appreciate you all taking the time to reach out. I'm so very touched and I'm sure Paul would be too. Browsing for a picture I found the last picture we ever took together. Unbeknownst to us back in January this would be our last ever holiday together. Andre's post was quickly inundated with comments from hundreds of Paul's devoted fans. Shona sympathized. Thinking of you so very much, my deepest sympathy, I cried. I loved Paul and watched him as Lily in the 1980s and then everything thereafter. He made me laugh through some of the worst times of my life. Jan also wrote. Thank you so much for sending such a caring message in a time which is so tragic and sad for you. Sending you my most deepest condolences. A wonderful photo of you both to treasure. Andre's post is the first time he has spoken out on social media since announcing Paul's shock death. Andre, who married Paul in 2017, said in a statement released in the early hours of Wednesday, It is with great sadness that I inform you that Paul has passed away unexpectedly but peacefully yesterday evening. He will be greatly missed by his loved ones, friends, family, animals and all those who enjoyed his humor, wit and compassion. I know that he would want me to thank you for all the love you have shown him over the years. A cause of death remains unknown. Paul's sudden death has rocked the nation and even the royal family. Shortly after the news was confirmed, Queen Consort Camilla led tributes in a statement. 